Faisal Schools, Rawal Pindi Islamabad. What is this? Is it a wallet? Someone must have dropped it. What should we do? <coughs> Let's take the money inside it. What do you think? No, we will not take it. But the vacation is coming soon, and we can use the money to go to the amusement park and have fun, and buy lots of candy. But Mohanad, this money is not ours. Don't you remember what the teacher told us two days ago? Honesty is one of the noble manners of Islam that Allah commanded us to observe. Allah says, indeed, Allah commands you to render trusts to whom they are due. The Prophet ﷺ gave us the best example of honesty and keeping trusts. He never took what did not belong to him. His people used to call him As-Sadiq Al-Amin, meaning the truthful and trustworthy. He وسلم, warned us against dishonesty and betrayal of trust. He told us that it is one of the signs of hypocrites. He said, There are three signs of a hypocrite. When he speaks, he lies. When he makes a promise, he breaks it. And when he is trusted, he betrays the trust. You are right, Omar. We will not betray the trust. We will give the wallet to the supervisor to return it to its owner. Yes, Dad. The supervisor returned the wallet to its owner, and our friend thanked us for our honesty. Well done, the both of you. You shall be generously rewarded for your honesty, Allah willing. And do not forget that honesty is not restricted to keeping money only. Secrets are a trust that we have to keep, and our bodies are a trust that we have to use in doing what pleases Allah. And worship is a trust that we have to fulfill on time, right Dad? Yes, well done, Muhammad. Let's then go to perform the prayer. Faisal Schools since 1978.